Hello, everybody. It's Romeo Valentine, 93.9 The Beat. And today we have a special guest. Okay, this this young girl is, you know, I want to call her the next up because she is going to be rising to her stardom. And it is happening as we speak. So we're catching the first, I want to say this is the first interview. Is this your first interview? Yes. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I want to introduce to you, I'm going to call her my niece, Kaya Mack. Hi. Kaya, tell us, uh, tell us a little. We're gonna learn a little bit about Kaya, okay? Kaya, how old are you? I am seven years old. Okay, and what what do you do? Do you dance, sing, act? I dance and sing, but when I was in first grade, I used to I used to do plays. Wow, plays! And Kaya, you're seven years old, which means she's probably in uh, second to third grade right now. Yeah. Wow, and she's already singing, dancing, and you know, Kaya, you actually uh, been through a lot, okay? And and as I was talking to your dad a little earlier, he was telling me about the stories, and of course, I've known uh, during the time of your birth of what was going on from uh, your dad, and you know, just you overcame a lot. I mean, could you tell us a little about that? Okay, so when I was first born, I had to stay four months in the hospital of my life because I had gastroschisis, which means my intestines were on the outside of my body. So mm. if it wasn't for the Ronda McDonald House, I would not be here today. So wow. if they weren't there, I would not be here today. Wow. So the Ronald McDonald House uh, made a huge impact, of course, on your life and everybody around you. You know, that's amazing. And uh, what, what also uh, w- I've noticed is that you are helping raise funds for the Ronald McDonald House. Is this your way of uh, trying to give back? That Are you on a mission to help give back to uh, Ronald McDonald House that has helped you? Yes. Because I want to help kids like me so they can feel better like me. How the Ronald McDonald House made me feel better too. Wow. See, this is just a blessing, you know, the the story that you're telling us, you know, that you're standing or sitting right here and in in front of all of us and uh, telling us this story, you know, it's just amazing. And, and if people want to donate, uh, how could they do that? If they would like to uh, make a monetary donation or they can go to kymac.com and then they can donate how much money they want okay donate. that's good you know and it, it goes to a great cause you know you get to see the faces and and just the lives that are changed this is just phenomenal and uh kaya mac is spelled k-a-i-y-a-m-a-c-k.com so you, you got it up on your website and all that good stuff yes. and you also got the fun stuff on your website you got some music up there Okay, what kind of me? What, what uh, you just released a Christmas song? Last Christmas, yes. You released it last Christmas, mm-hmm. or this Christmas? I'm just playing. <laughs> you released you released it last Christmas, okay? And uh, tell us, tell us, uh, how fun was it for you to jump in the studio uh, and make that song? It was pretty fun because I had the background dancers with me and my sister. She's so cute. Yeah. Yeah. How many siblings do you have? Two. Two. You have a uh, sister and a sister. You have two sisters. Yes. It's an all girls house. Yes. Wow. So there's you one boy, in, no, two boys in our house because we have an elf and daddy. Elf? Is it elf? Is it an elf on the shelf? Yes. You, did you touch him? No. Okay. Yeah. Don't touch him because I only sometimes for my music video, but the rest I'm just every time I touch him I put cinnamon back on him. <laughs> you put cinnamon? Is that the trick? Yeah. Because um, magic. My kids tell me not to touch elf on the shelf. We call him. We named him Northy. What is your name yours? It's a weird name. It's called Booker. Booker? <laughs> people people um, think his name is Booker. Booker. But it's Booker. Yeah, B-O-O-K-E-R, not B-O-O-G-E-R. Is it, you sure it's not Booger? Yes. Okay. Okay. When you sprinkle cinnamon, you're not sprinkling Booger, right? Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's, that's pretty cool. You know, um, did, what did you uh, tell elf, uh, your elf on the shelf, Booker? What did you what did you have you whispered to him you want for Christmas? I haven't told him anything yet, but I asked Santa, what can there be a day I can touch Elf without putting cinnamon on him again? <laughs> and he circled yes with a heart. What? Wow. That's cool. So where was the coolest place that you've seen your uh Booker? Where you seen Booker end up in your house? Um the first day on our TV eating all our chocolates. What? Did he have chocolate face? Um, no. On a scale of 1 to 10, how mad were you that he ate all your chocolate? My dad was mad. <laughs> <laughs> but he said, I'm going to be so mad if he eats his keto chocolates. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> your dad said that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Today, he's 
um, my dad didn't put his clothes away, so he's he made a house out of his clothes. Your dad? Oh, your dad didn't put. It, oh my gosh! So that just gives uh, tells your dad to put his clothes away. I mean, no, but we were me and mom were doing a competition, so we were gonna see how long that clothes were gonna stay, and if they stay how long that we want it, then we get breakfast in bed. But oh. I think since I told my dad to keep it there, I'm making her breakfast in bed tomorrow because she's probably mad at me. <laughs> Oh, do you ever help your dad fold his clothes? Because it sounds like he needs some help. My mom does. Your mom does? Who, okay, do you fold your own clothes? Sometimes. My mom does all the laundry, all the cleaning. Well, my wife too. <laughs> I think that's everybody's wife. I, I help. I try to help though. I mean, I, you know. I mean, daddy sometimes folds his own clothes, but like sometimes he washes the dishes. But I, once I cleaned up the whole house. You cleaned up the whole house and he didn't help? Um, no, he was dropping my sisters at school. Oh, he and was busy. I was home by myself because so, I was just on school. So oh. I made the whole house clean, and then he took me out for dinner, and, uh, and I mean lunch, and then we had ice cream after. What? What is your favorite ice cream? Cookies and cream. Oh, mine too. But I went vegan, so I eat vegan ice cream now. Mm. You ever had vegan ice cream? I don't know. It's I've just no dairy. I think <laughs> I just had keto ice cream keto ice cream is your dad making you on the keto diet or you just eat the food because it's there i mean because that was the only ice cream that we had oh yeah yeah ice cream is ice cream right but it tastes pretty good actually it doesn't, it doesn't taste that bad oh cool cool so what would you say okay well, going back to your song last christmas yes. what would you say is um is this is your first release right what would you say that you would love to see yourself in the next five years? Where would you, where would you see yourself? Obviously, you're going to be 12 years old. Where would you see yourself uh, with doing music? This is just a start from day one. Where do you see yourself in five years? I have no idea. <laughs> She's like cleaning my dad's laundry. That's where I'm going to see myself. <laughs> Folding it. <laughs> okay, so... You know this song last Christmas. Of course, uh, you you uh, I I heard that you are actually uh, giving the song for free to everyone who donates to the Ronald McDonald House. Is this true? Yes. So everybody who donates, if I go and donate right now, I can get the song for free. Yes. If uh, the person watching donates right now, they can get this song for free. Um. Yes. But the person behind them, we should charge them. Um. Yes. No, we're well, just kidding. <laughs> She's like, yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We're but not gonna you also it. can have my song for free on Spotify. Oh, and you stream it? Stream it? Tell them stream it up because uh, it's a great song. It's a great, uh, of course, a great feel. And uh, where did you actually film? Who actually filmed the music video for you? Uncle Valen. Uncle Valen. Very talented Uncle Valen, right? You have a lot of talented uncles, huh? Yes. Wow. <laughs> you do. And, um, you know, I, I, was, I was mentioning earlier, you know, me and you have something very uh, in common that I wouldn't say many people have. Both of our dads are from Trinidad. Mm, yes. That's crazy, right? That your dad is from Trinidad. My dad is from Trinidad. And, you know, when I told your dad that my dad was from Trinidad, you from Trinidad? <laughs> He's already, all my aunties and all my uncles, they all have that same uh, feng tua as your dad, as I want to call it. But have you picked up your dad's accent yet? Do you notice he has an accent? <laughs> um, I also can't read his handwriting so good. I only can read certain stuff. He what does he How does he write? Scribble, scrabble? No, he writes like cursive. Oh, they don't teach that in school anymore. We taught our daughter. I taught my daughter. Me and my wife taught I mean, our daughters I that. I kind of know cursive, but like, um, I don't know. <laughs> I it just can't read it so good. Yeah, once you practice, you'll get it down, I think. What's okay. your favorite subject in school? Math. Math? Seven plus eight. Seven plus eight equals... Hold on. Let me count it. Let me make sure I get this right. <laughs> Give me a second. Seven plus eight. Fifteen? Seven plus eight. Wait. Yeah, you're right. Your dad said no. You said yes. You're correct. <laughs> I heard your dad in the background. You said 15. He said no. Yeah. Seven plus eight is fifteen, because eight plus eight is sixteen. You just minus one. Seven, fifteen. Boom, 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 boom. Fire off two booms. <laughs> so, Kaya, I mean, you also have another song coming out. Okay, I got the sneak peek, but um, I mean, uh, soon enough, the rest of the world will be able to see this. You did a cover song for um, BTS. You did a reggae 
Remix. Yes. Okay, tell us about that. Um, that's one of, I think that's one of my favorite ones because it has so much effects in the background and he had shaved eyes and it was just so fun. And my sister, so good. She just pretended that she was throwing the ball in the hoop. Oh. But it was our arm. So what is, um, what exact song is this? The Dynamite Reggae Remix by BTS. Oh, the Dynamite song. That song is actually really popular right now. It was even in, um, Fortnite. I've seen it in Fortnite before. Yeah, right? It's on ads, too. Yeah, it's on all, a lot of ads. I think Samsung ads. Yeah. I think I've seen it on the Samsung ads. That's a really great song. Uh, BTS is definitely, uh, is that one of your favorite artists? Um, it's one of them, but my favorite favorite is Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande? Really? Is that with the one braid? Is, is that an Ariana Grande tribute because she likes to do her one hair in the back? No, she's just so good. I love her singing. So good. Oh yeah, what is your favorite song from Ariana? One last time. Oh. She's so high on that one. Oh, where she her voice is so high. Yeah, she has like a crazy range, she right? Can go as high as Mariah Carey. Yeah, they have that same little squeak. I want to like you know, a whistle note. Yeah, that yeah is that what it's called? I call it a squeak. <laughs> Sorry, uh, I have a professional. I gotta you know learn the ver- for the verbiage. Whistle note. It's called whistle note? Yes. Do you know how to do the whistle note? Not yet? I go on my head voice, though, but I don't think you want to hear that. It's so we, loud. We actually do want to hear you give us a little sample of something. Are you shy? No, I just don't want to do that. We we, we would really want to hear the, um, let's see, the last Christmas. Would you give us a little, like, 10 seconds? Okay. Last Christmas. I gave you my heart, but the very next day, you gave it away. This year, to save it from tears, I'll give it to someone special. Wow, right there, Kaya Mac, you came with it. That was awesome. Thank you. You're really good. Thank you. It's the first time I got to hear you sing live. I only seen it in the videos. <laughs> wow. Your dad is doing a great job with you, and uh, your sister's raising you guys so well. You got a good mom, and you have a great dad. And um, I I can see that they are so proud of you. Yeah. Do they tell you they're proud of you all the time? Yes. Yeah, what do they, what do they say, their exact words? Do it in your dad's voice, though. I mean, we, got, we got to do it in your dad's voice. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> <laughs> Kaya, I'm so proud of you. No, oh, that's not it. That's not it. I got to learn my <laughs> I got to learn my Johnny impersonation. I haven't learned that one yet. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, Kaya, I mean, we thank you so much for stopping by. This has been fun. Thank you, you tell so much too. You have anything else you want to tell us? Merry Christmas, everybody! So awesome to have you, and we're excited. Yeah, there we go. Hold on, do the little dance. What was that one? Is that is that TikTok? Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! She hit it. <laughs> I gotta learn. I gotta learn all that. I skipped me. I think that <laughs> that that dance styles kiss skipped me. I don't know how to you do it yet. Uncle Valen only knows how to do this one. Whoa! I think he's like I shaking off teach, a bug. I need to teach him. <laughs> I think he has something on his shoulder. That's what Uncle Valen will look like when he. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what, what does Uncle Valen only know how to do? One more time. Whoa, Uncle Valen! <laughs> Uncle Valen. That's the easiest one. That's the easiest one? <laughs> All you have to do is this and then clap. Wait, okay, okay. You don't say it's easy because I'm, <laughs> I'm going to try okay, it. Okay, you uh, just need to do this. Hold on, hold on. Let's see. Wait, what? This. <laughs> and then, yeah, basically like that and then clap. Yeah! For real, did I do it? I feel like I'm doing it awkward. Hold on, I got to Good snap. job. Hold on. Wait, how do you do it? Hold on. <coughs> like that. Wait, what? Move one arm up, and then clap. Yeah, basically like that. Yeah. Wait, wait. And then I gotta say yeah. Uh, yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Here we go. Three, two, one. Ah! <laughs> yeah, I you don't. You got it. Did I get it? Okay, all right. I tried. I tried. <laughs> we gotta tried. do a TikTok for last Christmas. Yeah. Is it on TikTok already? Is your song on TikTok? Yeah. Yes. Last Christmas. So if you go on TikTok, you can search it, and we're gonna do. 
<laughs> Boom. Call it the only dance move Uncle Valen can do. And now add Uncle Romeo to that list. <laughs> Uncle Romeo Valen time. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. Well, your we last think name is Valentine, and his name, his is first Val- name is Uncle Valen. So you just Valen Valentine. <laughs> right? Isn't that crazy? <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's what me and him joke about all the time. <laughs> all the time. <laughs> all the time. All the time. Me and Uncle Valen. We long time ago, little Kaya, when before you was born, we used to all hang out. Me, your daddy, your uncle. We also seen in one room and conversate. <laughs> around this time actually yeah i'm not joking every year <laughs> well we're so we're so proud of you we're so happy we're, we're excited to see more of you kaya and you know we're excited to see the dynamite drop boom and what else do you have do you have anything are you working on um are you working on uh, any originals are you working on any more music videos um i'm actually trying to write a song but it's not coming out how i want it Oh, well, I seven years old and you're writing a song. That's huge. And I can't even find the next beat that I want. <laughs> oh, my. Who's, who I wrote tra- the song, but I can't find the beat. And I just forgot the song because I didn't practice it yet. Wow. <laughs> you sound like you know exactly what you're doing in this field, you know. That's so cool. Because my daughters are like the same age as you, and they're, they're into a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, I, ha- I had one of my daughters playing football. Do you play sports? I'm capoeira, but I'm not good at any other. Oh, thing. capoeira, yeah. Oh, yeah. I seen the videos on Instagram of you doing it with your dad. Yeah, but that's I'm not really good cool. at like basketball or anything. Oh, it's okay. You're good at singing, I dancing. I mean, I'm kind of good. I can kind of do like dribble with one hand, but the rest I'm like not good at. I can't even sh- um, shoot a hole. Like I can't even do anything. Well, don't I feel bad. I look funny shooting basketball, so. <laughs> I don't know. Everybody laughs at how I shoot, so don't. It can't be any. I wouldn't laugh. <laughs> I'm like the same thing as you. I don't. I can't do that. I can't do that. <laughs> You're very kind, Kaya. Well, congratulations on your release of last Christmas, and we're excited for so much more to come. Um, ladies and gentlemen, give it up one more time for Kaya Mac. Thank you.